going to lunch today with Joe Fu. Joe Fu, where you at? Oh, snap. Joe Fu! What's up, man? What's up, dude? Come on. How are you? Not bad. Yourself? Chilling. How you doing, man? I'm doing well. Doing all right? Doing real good. Ready for some barbecue? I am ready for some barbecue. I'm not going to lie to you. Yeah? I stopped in there. Ah! On Saturday. Come on! <laughs> on Saturday. We were uh, supposed to experience this together, Joe. Right, right, right. But... I um something had happened. Uh, uh, was driving by on Saturday. You smelled the barbecue and, and uh, yeah, I was like, well, let me just see what they have going on. Like, and I didn't get too much. I just a little, and, and I wanted the support. Okay. I just wanted to get like a little, you, you know. I told you, man, Bob, he kills it. So, what's your blood type? Uh, to be honest, I don't even know for real. Okay. See the key. Because a lot of people are like, oh, Joe, I want to do your diet. I want to do what you did. And, you know, what I did isn't right for everyone. The first step is learning your blood type. And that kind of gives you a roadmap. See, I'm, I'm O. I'm O negative, which is the universal. The best diet to follow is the paleo diet. I do the bulletproof um, version of it. David Asprey created the bulletproof diet, which is where everything is so clean he uses intermittent fasting with uh, coffee. I've heard I, of that, I think. Like yeah, yeah. bulletproof coffee and how that can curb your hunger or something. Yeah. And your brain power. Uh, I haven't eaten since last night at 8 o'clock. See, I would die. No, you wouldn't. I would but die. But I, <laughs> I also fasted for 114 days. 52 days on water and an occasional unflavored Pedialyte. What? And then the rest was uh, on a juice fast went down this I, I feel like I lost baggage yeah baggage baggage right it was a whole transformation you know weight weight is, is you're carrying stuff and it's it's more than just weight and addiction to food you know, now I know what affects my body mm. normally I use a service called paleo to go okay and then I'll take a break to do lunches like this I don't want to say where I ate the other day right but it's a chain that says that they have healthy food they've had a couple problems but i ate that food and oh man just that sure. night and the next day in yoga i felt sorry for the lady sitting next oh, to me no. it was so bad my stomach was so messed up i'm so, I'm so sorry yeah i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm man. so sorry i'm so sorry <laughs> obnoxious but anyway i'm gonna learn i'm learning a few things here from my man joe but where are we going for lunch today is the question joe we are going to red wood what do you think about getting pretty much everything? I want to try it all. What up, Namarama? What's up, Bob? Probably not gonna eat anything else today. <laughs> we got the uh, extensive list of sauces KP's vinegar, hot sauce, famous Alabama white, espresso, barbecue. Like house barbecue. I'm just gonna run the ketchup. Where do I start? Alright, let's go with their, their sausage. It's so good. It's so good. It's crazy, right? Oh man. And I like Bob's food so much because he's he's not your traditional like barbecue pit master where he's abiding by all the rules. He adds his own flavor to it, his own spin to it, and it's very creative. That's what I, what I really dig about it. So it's really cool. Yeah. Oh man. This is the man here. The man. The guy that's just super tired. <laughs> you are tired. Super tired. But you know what? It's worth it. How Bob and I have had conversations before about working the nine to five grind and wanting to do this full time, and yep. now look at you. And now I can say I'm living the dream. Barbecue king of the Amber Rose. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> no, I'm just a good guy. It's kind of dumb that likes to watch fires for 16 hours. That's who I am. Well, I dig so, you, man. Cool. Dog yard here. So the both dog. these both these pits are named after my dogs. Yeah. So we got Daisy, who's a little squatty, ugly thing, just like my dog Daisy. And then we got Bubba, who's sleek and just like my dog. Your name is what again? Or Joe Fu. Bob. Yeah. Floyd. Joe Floyd. Um, yeah, so this is all our short cooked stuff. So there's our ribs, chicken. When we do pork belly, we got a turkey in here right now, right? Yeah. So, wait for the pork belly. so we got turkey breast that we're just playing around with, uh, playing around with right now. Um, yeah, so she's, they're both 100% wood fire. This is just, uh, the name of the pit is a primitive pit, 500 gallons. Of our Buley, which is... Buley? Yeah, the Buley. So, uh, and it's also wood fired 100% and basically the same thing as Daisy, just in a cabinet. So down here you have your fire box, four inches of refractory concrete and then a half inch of steel. So like that door alone weighs, I mean it's heavy. Yeah. Um, but that's the beauty of it, once you get it to temperature, you're good. We got uh, our butts and our briskets that are about on since 6 a.m. 6 a.m. 6 a.m. What so time do you get out of bed, Bob? I get out of bed right now at about 4.30, so we got it all the way down. We can do, if we push this, we can do 75 briskets at one time, all three levels. But right now we're just running with, this weekend's our first weekend with a food truck back yeah. out. Two catering gigs and this on a Saturday, so I, I, don't, know, I don't know how it's going to be, but you know what? You don't know until you try. We were so, right, right? I mean, so, we how do you know you can't do it if you don't try to do it? You got to try. I and feel you know like what? he was listening with to our, our conversation. Like his motto is, we don't fail, so you, we're going to do it. Okay. We were just talking about that, man. Yeah. You never know until you try. That's right. I you appreciate you saying that on traffic. camera. Yeah, step out in traffic. Step That's out right. in traffic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're so get, yeah, this is our, this our dog hit. yard. We just kind of sit out here and watch fires burn. I love it. So, nice. Thanks again, man. No problem. Appreciate Thank you. No problem. Glad you guys came out. That was so good. Yeah, I'm full now. I feel like it's time for a I'm nap. Like walking like this. <laughs> <laughs> I do have the meat sweats. <laughs> I do. Have Not four. Yeah. I, I smell like brisket. I got meat sweats. It's like perfume. Too. You got meat sweats too? You got meat sweats too. Yeah, now I gotta yeah. go out here and paint the sun. Yeah. You gotta make this space more beautiful than what it already is. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs>